people are being investigated with links to Russia. And I think this is another drip in the ocean of water that's coming. And it is problematic because every day as uh, President Trump is trying to, uh, you know, move forward with his agenda, he is, and the White House has this now, looming uh, cloud over it and they can't get rid of it. But Amy, let me add, I mean, just listen to how Wilbur Ross responded this morning. He did this CNBC interview in London. He was asked a lot about it. I thought his last answer the House was the most telling he as he pointed to the media. Listen. The trip to Moscow and what he told several other There's nothing wrong with it at all. I think it's just an example of the press trying to find anything they can, however remote or silly, to attack the president and somehow link him to Russia. This is nonsense. Nonsense? All about the media, Amy? <laughs> uh, no, I, I think, you know, if anything, they should have been crossing their T's and dotting their I's here. Everything connected to Russia is a story here, and I think, you know, with just reason, I think because everything, you know, the campaign has been showing links, there is an FBI investigation right now. I mean, everything is related to this, and I think they had to be very careful uh, going into this, knowing that Russia was such a big storyline. Ron, to you, switching gears completely here to the horrifying massacre at that church in Texas less than 24 hours ago. The president responding to it while he's on this trip in Asia. Listen to what he said. I think that uh, mental health is the problem here. This was a very, based on preliminary reports, very deranged individual. A lot of problems over a long period of time. We have a lot of mental health problems in our country, as do other countries. But this isn't a guns situation. Ron, your response on Twitter last night, uh, responding to House Speaker Paul Ryan, was the president was quick off the mark with a lot more policy than prayers after the New York City terror attack. What are your thoughts? Right. Well, look, this is this is the catechism at this point, and I think uh, it really is not. No one should expect any change from the administration. Uh, it really is how voters will react whenever there is a mass shooting uh, that involves uh, a white shooter, a native-born shooter.